We've learned the identity of Youngstown's latest uh, murder victim, Brandon Leonelli, a 24-year-old. The county coroner released his name after family had been notified. First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti listened to the 911 calls from the early morning shooting and tells us the incident left West Side neighbors pretty scared. The calls to Youngstown 911 started coming in shortly before 3 a.m. As police were on their way to the scene on Russell Avenue on the city's west side, one dispatcher notified an ambulance company to request paramedics. We have multiple calls on in, multiple 911 hangups, a female screaming, female screaming help, help. The neighbors can hear her screaming help, and they also heard gunshots. When officers did arrive, they found a man who'd been shot several times, as well as a woman who had been assaulted. In the meantime, calls continued, coming from frightened neighbors on the street, saying they could hear the victims, but weren't about to risk leaving their homes to look. He's outside? Yeah, I guess he's outside. I ain't going over there to get shot at. Yeah. Okay, no, stay, stay safe there. I'm scared to go outside. She's young. You heard a gunshot? You heard gunshot? Yeah. Yeah, I heard the gunshot. There was two of them. The male victim died a short time later at the hospital. At this point, police are not commenting on a possible motive in the case, other than to suggest the shooting was not a random act. Detectives are asking anyone with information to call either the department's tip line or Greater Youngstown Crime Stoppers. In Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.